sell your cars. Yes, Malaysia does produce uh, batteries, but is that the next step for Tesla, going up the supply chain? Yes, the understanding is, of course, bio-batteries. Yeah, and it's cheaper, it's uh, produced locally, and it is the advantage, it is what they say. Why should they bring on their batteries from all over the world? Is the end game assembly then, the complete supply chain in Malaysia for Tesla? Well, it's a bit too premature for me to commit because they are, they are doing it. But what is important is we do have the capacity to produce parts of battery what is required in the car. And looking as an overhaul by a military ministry committee is that uh, in, a, in, in the uh, comprehensive look at the entire uh, proposal, it is more um, beneficial than having to impose 20-30% equity. That's how we see it. And, and uh, similarly with, with Gili Proton, uh, because we have come up to a stage where there is readiness in the past. Like, like SpaceX, as I said, mm. you know, is, is three major players here. So, if SpaceX wants to operate here without any sort of equity, I would say fine because we have here enough capacity to produce spare parts for SpaceX. I want to ask you because Indonesia, as you well know, is going down that same road and it's caught a lot of people's attention because for the first time in modern memory, I think, right, Indonesia is not just, to be blunt, I think from the outside perspective, a hole in the ground to dig commodities out of, and the Indonesians basically extract rent, although they've been trying to keep more of the value added at home. They have a grand plan, up and down the supply chain, from batteries to mining all the way down to assembly and selling, maybe even export, out of the country. Is that Malaysia's plan as well, to compete with Indonesia? I would say um, is important neighbor to us and um, a lot in common. Um, we're working very well together, both in the government and private sector. And I think instead of uh, being in a game of fierce competition, we should be able to complement each other. And if that has been the spirit of my co series of conversations with President Jokowi and followed through by the industry. Hi, I'm Emily Tan and thanks for watching CNBC. You can check out more of our videos by clicking on the boxes on the screen and don't forget to subscribe to the channel for more. Thanks for watching.